we got the goods. It is just a pink package. I love it because I love pink. It says Miss A. I hope that everything is in here. It's not that big. So let's open it. Let me just get some scissors. Hold on. I don't want to give it this. So there's 17 items in total, just the receipt and everything. Let's put it there. They really take care of it. They have bubble wrap and then your foil, Miss A, another styrofoam. Like, okay, okay, girl, I see you. Here are all the items, like a little burrito. First thing I have here is all right, but enough talking, let me do my brows. As you all know, I normally do them with my Anastasia brow pomade, but okay, we can, we can do this with a cute little brush. It's definitely lighter than what I usually like to get. They look red. They look bright. <laughs> They look so red. Uh, I'm sorry guys. Y'all hate me, huh? Unsubscribe. Not my best brows, but okay, moving on. The next thing that I have is a brush. This is a AOA Studio whatever F14 brush. It's kind of bent. Oh my god. It's soft. It seems good quality. And I'm like grabbing it, and no hair seems to fall. And I'm gonna try to put these. Nope. Really good quality. I forgot what this one is for. I think it was a contour brush. Next step that I like to do in my makeup is once I'm done with my brows, I like to do eyeshadow. The primer that I got today was actually. I got this one. This is the Amuse Long Lasting Creaseless Creamy Dries Matte. I got this one in the shade Blank Canvas. And this gave me like a MAC Paint Pot vibes. And I never actually had an eyeshadow primer. I usually just use concealer because it, it works for me. It smells a little weird. The little opening is really small. So I, I can barely fit my finger in here. It's not blending well. Some parts blended nicely, others didn't. So moving to eyeshadow. I got really excited with the colors. They look so bright. The creasing, oh my God, guys. This is creasing. Well, I'm going to start with the pink. to see if I can pack on the color and it will show up and it definitely does oh my god I don't know I'm really trying to blend this but it's this is the best that we can do moving forward I'm going to get that little it's a red but it's like a orange red oh that is a good color that really helps the pink. It's not even blending right, oh my god. This color really is helping the pink pop out. Like, big difference. I'm really happy with this color. It's, it's popping. Like, that color really helped the hot pink like, look. I just take the same brush, because why not? And dive right into the purple. I'm gonna go straight under. Wow. I'm not gonna lie, these colors, they really are nice and neon. I am really loving this color. Like, I don't know, like maybe you just needed that really good blend. Okay, and then I'm going to conceal and I'm going to be using the concealer that I got from here. It smells like crayons. It does feel a little thick.
Oh my god, this is so hard. It's so thick. This is not my favorite concealer because it's it's so hard. The only way I have been able to blend it is I'm with my finger moving it everywhere and it's so oily but this is the best I can do. So the eyeshadows I like him except for the green one. It doesn't really look green. It looks yellow. Maybe because of the concealer. Moving on to foundation. This is the thing that I'm more worried about. I don't want my face to just burn off for a dollar foundation. This is the Amuse Cosmetics. The same brand as the brow pencil. I like the packaging. Look, can we just talk about it? It's leopardy and it says matte finish foundation. So it's definitely not liquidy. It is pretty. Okay, so I did shake a little bit. Ugh, okay, I'm scared. I need to do a little quick prayer. It is thick, so mm, I'm gonna try to do the tiniest amount, guys. Doesn't smell like anything. Doesn't burn yet. But I'm not sure if you could say this is matte. It kind of looks dewy. I would like to say this is way better than the e.l.f. foundation that I have tried. Just saying. Because the e.l.f. claims to be matte also. It is a hot mess. And it doesn't smell bad. It doesn't smell like anything. So thank God for that. I am pretty impressed. I thought it wasn't going to be bad. I thought it was going to be bad. If I'm being honest. But it's not. So that's impressed. I will do my finishing powder and i think it seems like a pretty good tone i swear i suck at color matching and especially online if i can't see it like this is so cute same brand aoa color 3031 and sand and it is a little crayon so we'll see That's usually the areas where I go. It's very creamy. Oh, let's do it. Let me just blend. I'll see if it helps. Oh my god, I'm, I'm gonna die blending. This is really cute. It blend really nicely. Nice little tone of color. It's alright, it's alright. Moving on to the concealer. Oh my god, I don't know how this is gonna work. I try to put a little bit because I really don't use a lot of concealer. Oh my god, this is horrible. Oh my god, this is not blending. And it wasn't easy to conceal. I had to drag back and forth this bunch. So let me just get the finishing powder from AOA. And let's conceal this. I really like the powder. Oh, thank goodness. The powder kind of minimized the concealing so it has some tone in it. Oh my god! There is a section for hair accessories and I got these cute little clips. Wow, the quality sucks, guys. It looks cute, but it is one big sticker. Let's use them for it now. I can't even see them. How do you how do girls like that? Is that the thing right now? 
All right, I'm cool now. Oh, I got a contour powder. This one actually had a lot of reviews, so I'm pretty excited to use this one. Oh, how cute! So it gives you your own little sponge, which of course I got to use. It smells like baby powder. Oh my god. <laughs> Oh my god, I think I messed up. I, I need backup. I'm gonna use this. Well, thank god that helped. <laughs> now, eyeliner. I got She Beauty. This one is matte eyeliner black. Oh, I hate these. I used to have one of these where it has like a hard edge. Not my favorite, uh, but we'll see. I don't like this one. All right, should I even try to do an eye wing eyeliner? No. Next thing I got is this one, Skinny Mascara, which I'm very excited because I think this is the smallest little one that I've ever seen. Oh my God. No. This is so tiny. I'm so excited. I can finally be able to do the bottoms without throwing everything. Do you see? I have pretty short lashes. Oh my God. I think I love this mascara. Oh my God, I'm having too much fun. This is, this is a great buy. Oh, the last items that I got, to be honest, I don't even know what this is. Oh, blush. I like it. It kind of reminds me of the color that I have, the Amazonian clay from Tarte. I like it. Gives me like a nice little rosiness. And finally, this for my face is this highlighter, which I find it pretty cute can you see that oh it's putty like oh my god it's moussey and powdery okay let's see how this looks hmm. but whenever i apply these types of highlighters i like using my little silicone blender because I don't know, I just find it that it blends really well on my skin. I like it. I really like it. It's so cool. I didn't even know it was like this. I got this lipstick for my lips. It's definitely not going to match my makeup right now, but it's like a burnt red orange I'm so sorry I don't know why I chose this color but it smells great it's a pretty color it just doesn't go with this look right now but it smells really good it doesn't smell chemically or nothing it smells like a little bit of candy but yeah Really pretty. I like the color. Just not with this. <laughs> this makeup looks so crazy. Like this lipstick does not go with this at all. Yes, I even started noticing that this yellow or it was supposed to be green. And then it turned to yellow and now it's turning orange because like I guess the pink whenever I close my eyes or look up it mixes. I look like a hot mess right now. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, so lastly, I am going to try on these eyelashes that hopefully you can just put everything together. I'm sorry I had to watch this. Like, I'm sorry. With and without. Okay, so I just put my hair down and I definitely switched to some sparkly lip gloss because I was feeling the vibe right now. So that is all the makeup that I have today for you guys i grabbed one item for each thing and yeah the thing that i'm most impressed with is if i'm being honest the foundation because i thought i was going to die but the shade is great it has good coverage it is not 
I don't know, I like it. I really like it. I really enjoyed the contour stick. The contour stick, the highlighter, face powder, uh, the lipstick, the foundation, and the mascara. So those were my favorite items that I got. Oh, and I forgot to mention that I really loved this brush and they also have an entire line of eyeshadow brushes like if you're interested in getting some brushes try these out because they're really good quality i mean it looks kind of cute in camera but if you guys could see me in person look i'll try to zoom in guys like creasing creasing like, oh. that is everything from miss a overall i mean it was like a half of the items i liked so oh my god and i also really love the lashes they are super simple so i'll be using these every day because they're simple and nice and wispy you can't even tell that i have them on but anyways they're really good so i love those too that is it for today's video guys thank you so much for watching if you enjoyed this video please give it a thumbs up subscribe to my channel and i'll see you guys next time bye